Yo, this is Chris, and I'm going to show you how to format this little guy. It's the Toshiba external hard drive, um, Canvio 3.0. Mine is um, 500 gigs. I really like this little guy. It's convenient. I actually have two of them right here. Let's see if I can even bring this one over there for you. There's two of them right here. And, um, yeah, they're really good. You fit a lot on there. Just like a hard drive, you just drag stuff there, delete it. Um, I've been building a few websites, so I download, like, the backups to my websites to these things, and they're really good. And, uh, yeah, pretty fast and everything. So this, I really recommend this. It's, like, a really good deal, too. Uh, I think it's, like, 60 or 70 bucks. I'll have a link below if you want to check it out. And, um, yeah, so this guy is actually formatted for Windows, for a PC, but if you have a Mac, which this video is about, you can format it for your Mac, and this is how you do it. All right, so you got Macintosh OS. You're going to bring up Finder, okay? It's usually the one to the far left with a little face there. That'll come up, and you want to go to Applications, and then down to Utilities. And click on that. And there's something in here called Disk Utility. It's the uh, hard drive with a stethoscope on it. Click on that guy. That'll bring this little page up here. It takes a second to load. And you want to go down to your Toshiba external hard drive. This one or this one. It doesn't really matter. And you're going to format this. And you're going to format it so it fits on a Mac. And this is how you do that. Next to first aid, before partition, will be erase. It's number two. Click on that one. Okay, and this is what you got to change here. It's on MS-DOS, so it would format for uh, DOS or PC-based Windows. You want to go down, or actually go up in this case, to Mac Operating System Extended, Mac OS Extended. Click on that. You can name your, uh, your hard drive. I'm going to put a lot of my website backups on this, so I'll put websites and then from there you click erase and then it'll ask you if you want to format it there's nothing on there you can't even use it when you get out of the box so you have to format it but this is how you do it for a Mac and you click on erase and it's like it's pretty quick here it took me so long to find out like how to do this the first time and below I'm going to put the same instructions uh, typed up as I did for for this right here so, um, kind of like an, an off-topic thing here. And anyway, it's, it's going to ask if I want to use websites as the new, name of my new external hard drive for a time machine. I don't want to do that because I'm not backing up necessarily my whole hard drive. I'm just using select things. So, I'm going to click, actually, yeah, I'll click like don't, don't use. And that should do it. Let me check on that. I go to the finder, and there it is, websites. You can, uh... You can drag whatever you want to it. Boom, there's my photo. All right, so, hey, that's, uh, that's how you format it for the Mac. I hope people found this without, like, searching around on the Internet for it. So, hope it was useful. It's my first ever, like, how to do something with a computer video. I usually talk about other things, so, cool.